on the surface, he's an everyday, all-American boy. But deep in his heart, he knows he's different, special. He's always asking himself, who am I? Then one day, that question is answered when Homelander flies down from the sky and says, with tears in his eyes, no tears. and says proudly, son, it's time for you to take your place by my side. And for Ryan, it feels surprising yet inevitable. He always knew he was destined for greatness. Because he came from greatness. Oh, 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 oh. <gasps> wow. Oh, buddy, can you believe that? What do you think? It's cool. Yes? You guess. <laughs> Uh, I think it looks amazing. Oh, so amazing. Really marketable. So marketable. The whole pitch blows. It does not blow. It blows harder than Nancy Reagan on the MGM backlog. I'm sorry. Why are you here? Vaught got rid of most of the sidekicks after gunpowder. The settlement succeeded profitability. Yeah, but I don't think Ryan is going to file an HR complaint against me. <laughs> <laughs> What? Ryan is the first natural-born superhero, and his brand needs to reflect that. He's not one of Vought's lab rat freaks. He was chosen by fate, God, whatever, to be the one who saves the world. Yes. But let's not forget why he is special, shall we? He's my son. Chosen by God, sure, but uh, made by me. The Chosen One narrative only works if he stands alone. Harry Potter, Neo, Luke Skywalker. Hollywood's trained people to fall in love with white boy lone saviors. So America will want to fall in love with Ryan. What is this? Oh, it's a crime itinerary. Your first save. Congratulations, son. I'm not on the call sheet. You wanted a kingdom for your son. I'm helping you. Excellent. Mm -hmm. Just as we discussed. Mm -hmm. Feel free to move forward. Thanks. Ah, if you don't mind. I'm here because Homelander wants me here. Because he trusts me. Listen, I know you're the smartest woman on earth. Smartest person. But let me give you some advice. You know, girls supporting girls. You cannot talk to Homelander like that. I'm telling the truth. You're so afraid of him, you plucked yourself bald. If I were you, I'd make myself useful. You know, get some lactation going and let him suck on those titties before you end up like Madeline Stillwell. Oh, Ashley, hey, what's up? <laughs> Just the girl boss I wanted to see. I've been looking everywhere for you. Hey, so I heard that Ryan's doing his first solo save. I want to talk to you about something. I have this idea. <clears throat> okay, so what if, and just hear me out on this, what if I was there? That's it. That's the pitch. You want to join a family-friendly PG save? While PETA still has you on their bestiality watch list? I swear to God. Stupid people who think they're smart make me want to eat my own shit. Why do you let her talk to you like that? She's just a b It's probably that time of the month. It's like a full moon thing, isn't it? You are a genetically superior being, and she's the evolutionary equivalent of a capybara. Capuchin. It's a giant rodent from South America. Mm -hmm. You're better than her. I like it. And you should be at the save. It's a good idea. Thank you. Once. 